Hello guys, so we are going to start our new channel. Actually, we have uh, been seeing that many of the freshers who are uh, who have not uh, studied properly in college, who who don't have hands on programming, who doesn't who don't understand how flow how Java programs work, how things happen, how programming is written, how codes are written. So we are creating mainly uh, this uh, uh, this channel. Uh, in this, we are not going to discuss any theory. Here, we will be discussing only programming for you. And uh, we swear we will try to put each and every program that is used in Java in the beginning. We will try to upload all such videos for you all. So just uh, subscribe us, just like our channel. And uh, here we start our first program. So this program is nothing but sum of two numbers. So obviously if it is sum of two numbers, so we will require two numbers to add and then print. So for that I just uh, created one package com.check.test. It is not, you can use default package also. There is no foundation for that. Second, don't worry about this. This is a scanner uh, class import that I will tell you where. So now we have created a class. Uh, now uh, we will create the main method. For that, uh, just type ma and then press control and blank space in Eclipse. This will create a easy shortcut for main method. Now press enter, it will open. After ma, press in control blank space, then enter. That will create a main method for you. Now we will create a scanner class object. Why scanner class? Because scanner class is scanner class is nothing but it helps us to take input from the user. And after calling a scanner class, you will have to pass system dot in. This is a parameter. Here system dot in is nothing but this in is for inputs. With a scanner class, we can define a string as well as uh, integers. Right now, we are trying to add two numbers, so we will take int. So now our scanner object is ready. So let's uh, let's first give a message to the user that uh, write your yeah, type first number. Now the now when we will execute this program, this line will be executed first. So now this will tell us the first number. Type the first number. For now we will have to generate that variable. For that let's define num1 this will be our first variable and uh, we will use that sc dot next int always remember that next int is used with a scanner class object to create an integer for a string it is next line we will discuss such things later whenever we will be getting such cases in more programs so now second message message type second number again use S sc object scanner class object for num2 equals to sc dot next int so now we when we will run this program this will generate first variable whatever we will type from keyboard this will store that value into this variable similarly this will take the variable and put it into num2 now our number one number two two numbers are ready now nothing we have to do we have to simply print that sum for the for print for system dot out dot print ln the shortcut is syso then control blank space and that will create a uh, system dot out dot print ln for you now give the message the sum of the numbers is here we will use plus because in java when you in the string and then trying to print the variable for that you will have to use plus so that is uh, num1 plus num2 sorry num2 or you can also do something like this uh, here we, first let me show you so let's run we have run this program so it is asking that type the first number suppose it is 12 now the second message is there type second number so suppose it is 13 now you can see the sum is sum of the numbers is 25 yeah so i was saying you can directly print or if you want to store it into some third variable like int sum equals to you can do like this also num1 plus num2 here we have defined a new variable sum type int and then we are uh, we already have two numbers of int type so we have added them together and put it into it and here nothing you will have to do here you will have to put it sum that's it again when you will run it for running always remember alt plus l alt plus r will pop up will give you this pop up now run this so again type the first number suppose this is something suppose this is 11 so here you can see the sum of the numbers so the uh, so this was our first video sum of two numbers we will try to upload more videos the good videos for the good programs and i hope you all will love this thank you